beautiful people welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel a new day a new adventure and today i'm joined by a, a great friend of mine fiona hi Hello guys. by the way guys we've known each other for over a decade yeah we were primary school classmates yeah. <laughs> good friends good friends we were, we were actually uh, in a group best of friends. four best friends <laughs> and we used to dance and do all those things and yeah we've kept in touch over the years and you know right now we're here the the trip has finally made it out of the group chat so we're going to enjoy ourselves so right now we're at the hub karen and we're going to jump by flying fox which is still in karen the hub karen we're, go we're going to enjoy a couple of activities today we're going to zip line we're going to do maybe the airbag jump or just other activities and we're going to show you what to expect when you come here the prices of the activities and anything else that you may want to know before you come here and so it's your first time zip lining yeah how do you feel about it oh I'm so scared actually actually don't think that it's zip line but i think i must because that's what i you came to here do. to do yeah so there's no backing out at the yeah. last minute so we'll see how it goes so come with us and let's go <laughs> Guys, look at this place. It's so beautiful. The manicured lawns, the beautiful pond. But look at this place. You can literally just come here for a really nice picnic. Beautiful. jump by flying fox this place is so beautiful look at this mini waterfall very relaxing place relaxing sound so guys i'm here today with the instructor at jump by flying fox and i wanted um can you please introduce yourself okay thank you guys my name is gabriel Zekes. i work here as an instructor okay jump will be a separate Life. Okay, yeah. so I wanted to ask you like what are the some of the activities that you offer and what are the prices? Well, we have a variety of activities. Okay. So the first mother line of all activities mm -hmm. is what we call zip lining. Zip lining, okay. Well, we have a practicing point where we do it from the lowest point. But yeah. so once you get the right technique of doing the zip line, mm -hmm. we can proceed to the main cable once you get it right. Oh, okay. Then on the other side we have the airbag jump. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's a normal, just like a bouncy castle, but on this one we have to show you the technique okay. where we start with the first level, which, which is, is the lowest the level, lowest level okay. which is five meters from the ground. Okay. Then we go to the second level, which is seven meters, okay. and the ultimate jump turns out to be ten meters. Okay. Yeah. So um, still we have the jump swing. Jump swing is a normal swing, okay. but on this point we take precautions a lot. Okay. Bring where we pull it up, okay. and we give you a sudden pull, okay. and then quick release where you have fun. Then we have wall climbing, it's okay. basically just climbing the wall. Okay. Where we show you the technique, give you the gears, and we have also the opposite of the wall climbing, which is called upsailing. Upsailing. Yeah. So if you pay for the wall climbing, yeah, the upsailing is just free. Yeah, so you'll do the wall climbing, yeah. but at the same time you'll upset down. Yeah. But we have another point where you can do or maybe 10 to have the upside in alone. So you just you just go up climbing. like you're taking up and then you just start yeah, coming down start instead of climbing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, and I wanted to ask for the prices. The prices okay. So yeah. Yeah, the zip line, genting and a bag which are 1,500, mm -hmm. where for kids which are 1,100. For, for each the, activity. For each activity. Okay. And for the... <laughs> 
for the absolute impact and the leap of faith uh, together with the work climbing which are the 1200 for adults and the 1000 for kids okay. and still we also have another activity where we call the mini zip which is a small zip line for kids okay. where small kids who are two years three years yeah. can do it even okay. four years so that's the the, the lowest one, the lowest one right there the practice point for adults okay. is the mini zip for kids which are okay. the, the, a thousand per kid a thousand per kid okay and we then, also have good offers mm -hmm. sometimes mm -hmm. Whenever you do a lot of activities, we tend to give a very good discount. Like if you do two activities, we give you to 15 percent. Uh -huh. If you have to happen to do four activities, uh -huh. we give you 20 percent. And if you happen to do all activities, uh -huh. you get a 25 percent discount. Okay. And yeah. guys, if you also pay for two activities, you get an additional activity yeah, for free. But that's always on the weekday. Valid. Weekdays. It's not yeah. Valid on holidays and weekends. Okay. Yeah. So thank you so much. Thank you so much. practice a zip line for adults you have to use this one first before you go to the main zip line and the instructor was telling us how to properly sit and apply brakes while zip lining hey. so ready uh, three two one <laughs> How was it? <laughs> nice breakfast. You will see. No, you're okay. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. It's not our breakfast around time. It's supposed to break the day. Oh, the right hand. You got me about the top of the time. Let's go to the big one. I'm ready. Chukuliwa, chukuliwa. So I really wanted to do the airbag jump after zip lining and we decided to do it. In air 
back jump, you begin with the lowest level. And after you have learned the proper jumping and landing technique, you can then proceed to the second and the third level, which are higher. So we have the rules here. Mm -hmm. uh, we have these three rules where we don't allow people to jump mm -hmm. with the belly first, uh -huh. the first, and maybe the head first. Oh, of course. Uh -huh. We only allow you to jump on your back, on your back, landing on your back, on your back, with your hands across the chest. Like so it's all about foot and foot, we have to jump on your back. Like that, and then you get into the point where you want to miss out. And you just jump, and then back. Miss them out, one foot, forward. Yeah. And then, bye, bye. So you're not supposed to wear any safety harnesses and you're not supposed to jump with any personal items like keys. And the instructor demonstrated how we were supposed to jump before we began. Oh, you roll and then... Oh, in the chini. Will I remember those things? So, you know, adrenaline is major. But it's good that you can at the first level. Yeah, yeah. get you to the second one too. Woo! You can do it, Rosie. Three, two, one, jump! Just so it's a bit. It's a bit so key. <laughs> you can't swim in competition. I was not supposed to land on my feet because it's not the safe landing technique, but unfortunately, I did. And this was the first level, so I had to get this technique right before proceeding to a higher point. <laughs> Some of you can become a combat drill. Okay. Walk with your four. So my friend Fiona also got the opportunity to try out this challenge and she did really well. Just watch and see. Well, my good friend Stanley also decided to try out this challenge and he helped us to film a lot of videos on this day so kudos to him. <laughs> Surely, Chungo is in the Now you see, you know, she must have experienced. <laughs> Tell us about it. It's scary. Uh -huh. And also How comes you land in Mugu, Bwana? Sinafani land in Mugu. Ona, 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 so I jumped twice but failed to land safely so I decided to do wall climbing instead. Yes, yes. 